never let the narcissist disrespect you. Never let them act in an insulting way towards you. Never let them act rude, impolite or offensive towards you. Sadly, this is something most victims of narcissistic abuse do not do. They give their power away to the narcissist. Because they think that it will make the narcissist cooperate with them. Or because they want their validation. Or because they're just afraid of what might happen if they don't hand over their power. But you must show courage and determination. You must show that you are not going to tolerate it. You must set boundaries to protect yourself. Because they're always looking for weaknesses. They're always looking for something that they can exploit. So don't let them disrespect you. Stop giving them a chance after chance. If they really want to get it right, they will get it right the first time. Don't believe their excuses. It's intentional behavior. They know what they're doing. They're testing you. They want to see how you react to it. Because they want to see how far they can push you. They want to see where your threshold is. They want to see what you're willing to accept. So that they can push it a little further the next time. And the next time. Until one day you're wondering how it got to this point. where you've become a doormat for the narcissist. And you just accept it. Because they gradually stepped over all of your boundaries and broke all of your rules. or you never had any to begin with, which is why you may now be in a situation where they're just walking all over you. They have no respect for you. They don't care about how they treat you because they know you're always going to give them another chance. And they know there's always going to be someone else that they can manipulate. Someone who will believe everything they say. They know that they can always get attention somewhere else. Because it's often the people that are the least attractive and have no direction in life that get the most attention. Which is why even if the narcissist is overweight and has no job, they still have no problem moving on. Because there's plenty of people out there that are just as fake and desperate as they are. Which you can see on social media or dating apps. And there's nothing you can do to change that. 
You just have to change what you are willing to accept. Set your standard. Set strong boundaries. If they act like an unruly child, tell them to get out. Tell them to leave. You must have a standard. Because narcissists will test you. They will want to see how far they can go with you. If you let them get away with it once, they're just going to do it again and again. Which is why you have to draw a line in the sand right from the start. Or it will happen again and again. It will become a pattern. They will treat you like their workhorse. They will see you as an object that exists to serve them. Which is why you have to say no. You have to set boundaries. Don't let them disrespect you. Show courage. Or they will continue to walk all over you. They will do whatever they want. But when you set a boundary and you're willing to cut them off, that is when they will make adjustments. That is when they will start acting right. Not because they care about you. But because they're afraid that you might leave. They're afraid that they might lose the benefits and conveniences that you are providing to them. Respect yourself and the narcissist will be forced to respect you or they will not be able to be around you anymore because you're not going to tolerate it. So either way you win, you get the result that you want. Because you shouldn't want someone like that around you anyway. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.